Amy at YourLuxHome.com. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Remember to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and maybe even share it with a friend who might also enjoy learning about European antiques. I thought it would be really fun this week to celebrate the Thanksgiving holiday by looking at the history of Thanksgiving. So here in the U.S., Thanksgiving officially started as a holiday in 1941. Franklin, President Franklin Delano Roosevelt and Congress made it official uh, as the fourth Thursday in November. And traditionally, we all enjoyed turkey and stuffing and cranberries and don't forget the pumpkin pie. In my family, my favorite dish is the green bean casserole and I love oyster dressing. Uh, and Greg makes a really mean pumpkin pie. So those are my favorites. Uh, but it hasn't always been that as the traditional Thanksgiving meal. So if we look all the way back to 1621, it is thought that the first Thanksgiving held here in the U.S. was in Plymouth, Massachusetts, between the American colonists and the Wampanoag people, the Native Americans that lived in that area. And the feast supposedly was for 140 people and only four women actually were present to cook and clean for all those people. So that part of the tradition continues today. Uh, but the meal was maybe a little different. Supposedly the English brought fowl. And so maybe that's where our tradition of turkeys come from, but most likely they, it was probably ducks or geese. And then the Wampanoag people were said to have brought five deer. So venison was on the menu. And then of course they added lots of vegetables and corn um, and uh, of course cranberries and gooseberries. Um, fish and eels and shellfish were probably on the menu too. Maybe even my favorite oyster dressing. Um, but the really big bummer though is that because they didn't have flour or sugar, there definitely was no pumpkin pie. Um, I, I really love the pumpkin pie, so that would have been a big bummer. Uh, but at any rate, Thanksgiving is a wonderful time to think about everything that you have to be grateful in your life. And there's often a lot of family traditions that everyone has uh, in their own family. So today we're standing here in front of the Eurolux Home Gallery to show you our family tradition here at Eurolux. And what you see behind me is a massive collection of pilgrims. Uh, this collection was started by my mother-in-law, Kathy, back in the 1970s. She went to a Hallmark store and found a little set of Pilgrim salt and pepper shakers after Thanksgiving one year, and she bought them, and that started the whole thing. So this is a 50-year strong, lifelong collection. Uh, at our last count, there were over a thousand pilgrims in the collection. So this, is, this window is only part of the collection. Let's go see the rest. As you can see, we have lots and lots of pilgrims that decorate our front windows. We put them in for our city's big Oktoberfest celebration at the first weekend of October and leave them all the way through Thanksgiving. And it really has become sort of something to do here in our little town of Newberry, South Carolina. People enjoy bringing their visitors here to look at our uh, collection. Now, they're not for sale. Sometimes people do get upset if they can't buy one of the pilgrims, but this is Kathy's lifelong collection, and I probably would be disin disinherited if I sold one. Now, one of my favorite things about Kathy's collection is that Kathy actually has a pilgrim dating service. Uh, she can't let a pilgrim go past her path, even if it's just a single man or a single lady. Those are the ones that she especially likes to buy so that she can match them up. And it's just crazy, but a lot of times she finds one that actually is a perfect match. 
Kathy feels that everyone just decorates for Halloween and then they skip over Thanksgiving and go right into Christmas. And no one takes the time to focus on or decorate for Thanksgiving. And she really believes that the pilgrims represent the sacrifice and dedication and work ethic that our country was founded on. And so it's important to celebrate that. So we'd love to hear from you in the comments below about your own family traditions. But here at Eurolux, we just love Thanksgiving because it's a celebration of family and friends and everything that there is to be grateful for in your life. And so from our small family business to you and yours, happy Thanksgiving.